Hi there, I'm Ru, and welcome to this month's Norwegian lesson. This time I'm going to teach you all about the Norwegian kitchen and all the things in it. Get ready to get your Norwegian on! Yay! First I'm going to list all the words and then afterwards when I've listed all of them we're going to repeat it and you can repeat after me so just in the beginning just listen and take in all the beautiful words as they come flowing towards you and then afterwards we can repeat it and you can become the master of the Norwegian kitchen words. Okay, kitchen in Norwegian is kjøkken. And it's got one of those weird Norwegian way to pronounce things kind of thing going on. Now the thing about the kitchen is a lot of the items in the kitchen begin with kitchen stove. As in the word for that thing is described as in it's a kitchen thing. So you just take the word kitchen, chicken, and you add the word for the thing you're about to talk about and learn about. Okay? Let me list those words. Kitchen stove, chicken oven. Kitchen sink, chicken vask. Kitchen counter, chicken bink. Kitchen cupboard, chicken scop. It's the same in both the singular and the plural form, so no matter how many kitchen cupboards you have, it's chicken scop. One chicken scop and many chicken scop. Kitchen drawer is chicken skuffe. The plural form is chicken skuffe. So you just take chicken skuffe and add r. Chicken skuffe. Kitchen fan is chicken vifte. Although many of the items in the kitchen has the word kitchen in front of them, not all of them do. Let me list some of those. Refrigerator is kjøleskap. Kjøleskap. Cooling cupboard. Kjøleskap. Freezer is friser. So it's really similar. Friser. Dishwasher is oppvaskmaskin. Dishwashing machine. Oppvaskmaskin. Frying pan is stekepanne. A saucepan is kasserolle. Hot plate, varmeplate. Now the Norwegian word for hot plate is the same word for all the plates on top of the stove. So varmeplate is the thing on top of your stove too that warms your food, not just one singular little device. Varmeplate. Paper towels is tørkepapir. Tørkepapir. Wiping towels. A roll of paper towels is tørkerull. Tørke rull, wiping roll. Soap dispenser is såpe dispenser. See, it's almost the same. We just lured a O in there, one of our special letters. So we just say såpe dispenser. Now, for those of you who saw my previous lesson last month, which was the bedroom, the Norwegian bedroom, and let's not be naughty and think naughty thoughts now. I don't know why I said that. But if you saw that lesson, you'll know that I taught you that blinds is rullegardin. And although that is true, we also have another word for it, which is pasjenner. I know it's our word, but pasjenner. Sounds really exotic and fancy schmancy. We probably borrowed it from a different language because we thought it was a nice word. But yeah, that's another word for blinds. Pasjenner. Now it's come to the time where we go over the words. I'll say the word, and then I'll give you some time to repeat it. I'll say it in Norwegian, but the meaning of it and the spelling of it in Norwegian is going to magically appear in front of my face. So let's get started. Kjøkken. Kjøkkenvask. Kjøkkenbenk. Kjøkkenskap. Kjøkkenskuffe. Kjøkkenskuffer. Kjøkkenvifte. Kjøleskap. Friser. Oppvaskmaskin. Stekepanne. Kasserolle. Varmeplate. Tørkepapir. 
Fyrke papir. Tørkerull. Såpedispenser. Persienner. That's all the words for this lesson. I hope you had a ton of fun and that you're a few Norwegian words richer. Each month I have a new lesson. Next month's lesson is going to be all about the Norwegian living room, the words for things. It might interest you to know that in my Etsy shop I offer instant digital download of written assignments that go along with these lessons. They're affordable, they're fun, and it could be a great tool for you to practice your grammar and also the remembering of the words. So definitely check that out. The link is in the description. If you liked that lesson, if you had fun, and you learned some Norwegian today, then like it and share it with your friends and total strangers on the internet. Maybe they too want to learn Norwegian. If you're not a subscriber of mine, click the subscribe button to become a mustache, a citizen of the mustache kingdom. Around my face, clickable, and annotations are my regulars. Totally check those out. And all my other Norwegian lessons, because I have many, and they are fun and easy to learn, and you should check them out.